Welcome, you crazy knife nuts. Today we're going to talk about something that you all want to talk about. Your favorite knife, the one and only and ever popular Dalika. That's right, one of your favorite knives. And I want to talk about all the reasons why you love the Dalika. First off, it's a pinned construction. So there is no way to actually take this thing apart. Unless you take your drill bit and drill it out, um, you cannot take this apart. So it's pinned construction on top of a plastic. And I'm not talking about FRN or you know some of your fancier plastics. I'm talking about plastic. Um, and I know you all love plastic. It makes the best handle material. Um, the pocket clip. I'm sure you all love this pocket clip, which is also molded plastic. There is very little space in there. Um, oops. There is no um, ramp, and the end of this pocket clip is... Um, square so it it can't get into your pocket you can't even hardly I mean literally you got to get your nail under it um, very little clearance so yeah that's why you guys love that pocket clip as always the uh, lanyard hole is more important than the pocket clip so that gets placed right on the end so the Dalica is not even deep carry Let's talk about the blade. Okay, first of all, it's about 95% uh, serrated with just a very small portion. It's got what you would maybe call a saber grind, although, I don't know, not really. Comes out of the container completely dull. I mean, completely dull course we have the ever popular stainless steel it's soft as butter thumb stud um, just a piece of plastic 100% um, of the time they fall out I put a drop of glue on mine to actually hold it in there um, so yeah you have that the action on these, I guess it depends. The action varies widely from Dalica to Dalica. This one here, the pin, when they pinned it, the tension seems actually about right. Not quite too stiff, um, not too loose. I know some of them that have been very loose, where it's literally like a drop shutty action. And I also have one that's very tight. So the action is very inconsistent at best. And it's also always very gritty. The uh, stainless steel on plastic with no washers. Um, yeah. This one does actually lock up, which is quite surprising. Um, so there. There's your Dalica. Here's another one. Um, with the action which is pretty tight um, the thumb stud did fall out so I replaced it with a solid brass acorn nut which is well it's freaking awesome action gritty as heck but the interesting thing about this one is it's a slip joint the lock doesn't work so yeah but I thought to myself, there's got to be something better. Um, there has to be. So at $1, you get the Dalica. And for $3 and some change, you get this awesome upgraded version. And what you get here is a pivot that can be removed and adjusted. Although the odd thing is... The pivot is also what holds the 
uh, pocket clip in. The pocket clip goes from literally no room at all to enough room where you could park a car under there. Um, so yeah, but I will admit the tension on it's pretty nice and it does have a ramp so you can get it in and out of your pocket. Um, one thing they did screw up though, we have tip down carry, at least the Dalica, um, you know, did come tip up carry, which was pretty cool. So they got the pocket clip wrong. The blade, well, they got rid of the serrations, which was nice. And they upgraded the steel to Maxim. That's a great upgrade. I think Maxim is the Chinese version of Maximet. Um, they did just get rid of the thumb stud and went with the spidey hole, which actually works pretty well. You can get in here and slow roll it. Um... The tension on this is really, really hard, so you can't really spidey flick it, but, I mean, it is a back lock. Fit and finish, you know, the spring comes out there real proud. Still just plastic, um, but no texturing under the pocket clip, so that's nice. So that's what you get for, like, $3. Uh, pretty nice upgrade, I guess. And then... Finally, I guess if you really want to bite the bullet, you can get yourself the actual Spider Code Delica. A timeless classic. Um, I did get this one in Saber Grind. VG10 steel. As you can see, there's some love on this one. It's been carried. Pocket clip. Just about perfect, other than. Um, I'd prefer deep carry. There are many aftermarket options for that, so you can definitely do that. But, the Spider Codelica. Let me know which one you guys prefer. Do you really want to go the high dollar real deal and get the Dalica? Do you want to go the ever popular $3 Maxim? Or do you like to stick with the traditional, tried and true, Delica? Hope you guys all have a wonderful day. Thanks for watching.